Hey friends, we're playing this mod. Mario Kart Deluxe for Nintendo DS. That logo looks a little weird, but that's okay. So this is a Mario Kart DS mod, which I didn't even know existed. I didn't even know DS mods... Well, I knew DS mods existed. Yeah. Existed. Wow, my tongue is tied. I didn't know Mario Kart DS mods existed, so this is interesting. Uh, we'll see how this is. I don't know much about it, actually. I just know it's kind of like Mario Kart 8, or Mario Kart 8 Deluxe, I think. I don't think there's any settings. I, I should probably edit my nickname. What's my nickname on here? Yop Yop. Maybe that's the, uh, the mod creator. I gotta have Dawn. So we're actually gonna try to, like, actually play this and try to, like, possibly do Grand Prix to unlock characters. Because I want to see what if they change the unlockable characters, if anything. That's probably what they did. Now, how do you unlock the characters? There's some that you get from the mission modes, I think. Oh, we'll just do 150 first. Uh, okay. So, oh, Mario has Cappy. That's cute. <laughs> What is that? Oh, who's that? That's not a toad. Oh wait, that's uh, that's not <laughs> that's not Wario either. <laughs> oh no. Oh, he actually has Crash Bandicoot's noises. Ah, oh, it's Dry Bowser, I think. That's cute. Yeah, we'll play Peach. Um, she's got high drift. So we'll just do them in order. I'm not even gonna look at the list. You know, I'm not even looking at the list. We got Mario Stadium from the Wii U. I love Mario Kart DS, if you were not aware. It's like one of my favorite uh, Mario Kart games. It actually might actually be my favorite Mario Kart game. Okay, her drift is like really high, but like kind of obnoxiously high. Actually, she's not so bad. I'm used to playing as Yoshi, but Peach is pretty good. I gotta, I gotta keep that cute aesthetic. Um, the bottom screen isn't showing the map, which I'm guessing is probably... Oh wait, did they add coins? I think they might have added coins. That's pretty cool. And they have this really funny... Uh... Oh, it's Leon! It's Leon Kennedy! Oh, Toad is Leon! I was... Okay, I totally was like, who the fuck? Okay, it must be Leon from Resident Evil. That's so friggin' funny. That's my banana I just slipped on. That's cool. Ouch. So Mario Kart DS is pretty cool. It's probably one of the most, like, strategic Mario Kart games because you can snake in it, which I'm probably not gonna do because I am... bad. Also, are the computers, like, programmed to do these tracks correctly? I wonder how that works. I hope it takes an obnoxious amount of, like, programming to do that. They seem to all be in a very straight line back there. I'm curious if they're just kind of programmed to just do the track. I don't know how the AI works in Mario Kart, so I'm not gonna pretend I know. I was paying attention to the bottom screen. That was kind of cool. So that's the Wii U first Wii U stage. Um, I think there are parts of it. Sorry about that. I think there are parts of it that have like zero gravity that they just kind of either edited it out or changed. Yeah, this is Moomin Meadows from the Wii game. This, I know this one. Oh god, how did I just fall? The little things that are weirding me out. There are also a lot of stats in Mario Kart DS. Like, I don't know if you saw that, but when I was choosing my character, like, drifting is a stat. Also, those cows are hilarious. Are you kidding me? They're just, like, standing still. Oh, they actually edited the stages a little bit. Actually, well, I think... I think this stage was in Mario Kart 7 for the 3DS, I think. Don't quote me on that. Oh, I got three bananas. I'm just gonna keep this, because, yeah, this is just gonna be a, a little, a little Mr. Man, dude. A little, uh, little stinker with that red shell. Yeah, that's what I thought. And also, I think the way rubber banding worked in Mario Kart DS, yeah, I don't know if that still applies to this mod. I don't know if they change anything. It usually is, uh, they get mushrooms a lot, I think. There's always rubber banding with CPUs, so they'll, like, either have a speed boost or they'll teleport forward or something. I win, and the camera is doing something. Oh, there we go. That's funny, because obviously this is, uh, it's probably insanely difficult to have things work consistently with mods like this, so it's kind of funny to see it kind of glitch out a little bit, yeah, like that. This is Toad's Factory, wow. So these are 
also, I'm not really talking about this, but these are insanely impressive so far. <laughs> Again, I don't know how you mod, uh, what you can say, mod Mario Kart DS. That sounds pretty complicated, but, I mean, this is pretty well done. These move? Oh, they're just... What? What the hell? Okay. That's weird. Oh, so this speeds you up and the other one just slows you down, I think. That's their equivalent of the backwards, like, the conveyor belts. See, I don't remember... A lot of the Mario Kart Wii stages are kind of lost in my memory banks because uh, Mario Kart Wii was not my favorite one. What is Wario doing? Those things move? Doesn't look like it. <laughs> I'm pretty sure those things like squished you in the other ones. You have to jump over that little gap. I am like exclusively in third place right now, and it's kind of bothering me. Okay. Also, Mario Kart DS computers remember swerve a lot. They like swerve back and forth a lot. I just remember that being really annoying because they would like unintentionally dodge stuff and I'd be like, please stop. <laughs> Mario Kart DS was also before the uh, the balancing thing came into Mario Kart where if you're holding an item behind you, it still counts, like it's still in your inventory. So you can basically, in a lot of situations, have two items out at the same time if you do it correctly. Yeah, I didn't fall for that again. Ooh. That was the first one I kind of had a little trouble with. The CPUs were kind of keeping up. I can't believe Toad is Leon Kennedy. I don't think I don't even know how I didn't recognize that. What is this? Peach's Castle N64. This was not a stage in Mario Kart 64. Ouch! What? This is totally new. What? Okay, so I saw this, but I did not watch the trailer. This was probably in the trailer. This is something I'm sure they showed off. Wow, that's really cool. Why does no one have any items? Haha. This is really cool. Wow, I'm like, sorry, I'm like silent. The mu There's not really much music going on. Ow. Well, there is music, but I can barely hear it. I kind of like this, though. This is like a cool... <laughs> this is a cool idea. This is one of those stages that would, like, in a newer Mario Kart game, would do something clever where, like, depending on the lap you're on, it, like, changes. Ooh. That was the first blue shell I've encountered, actually. Also, the uh, computers tend to freak out with ink in this game, too. Oof. Okay. Cool. That was actually cool. <laughs> I didn't think there would be an original stage. I thought that was just all remakes. That's pretty impressive. I wonder if that's, like, ripped from Mario 64 DS or something. There's no sound. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> Crash Bandicoot is killing me. I didn't even notice him. I didn't even notice Crash Bandicoot, like competing. Why is there no sound? I, I'm not, this isn't like an edit. Yay, I win. Cool. I got a star. Okay, let's try that again. This is Wario's gold mine from Mario Kart DS, which is, or not Mario Kart DS, Mario Kart Wii, which is pretty cool. Ow. Here she. They are bumping into the walls. That's funny. Please die. This guy is really fast compared to me. I guess. I guess Peach has pretty bad top speed. But he's really catching up! Okay, wait, what? I got distracted. He got. He was catching up so fast! Yoshi, get back here.
Why is he like in the walls? <laughs> That's so weird. <laughs> Missed. I'm, like trying to decipher where he is with that like weird mini map, but it's not really working out. Yeah. Why'd you get so slow all of a sudden? <laughs> CPUs are weird. Sure, with a modded game, they're destined to be weird, but. I've never really experienced a modded game with, like, AI like this, so... Like, did I just laugh Luigi? Like, where was Luigi? Am I crazy? Luigi was on the minimap just now, but he, like, wasn't anywhere to be found. <laughs> Again, don't take, this a, don't take this the wrong way. This mod is, like, insanely, insanely impressive. It's just funny to see some of the, uh... Probably some of the hurdles that come with making such a intricate and impressive mod. And I think a lot of that has to do with the AI. Ooh. I don't think this one was in Mario DS. I, probably. I'm guessing everything's been... It's like this game is whole, totally 180'd. Wow. It's pretty cool. What the heck? I just got like suction to the wall. That was weird. <laughs> that was really weird. Okay. Well, that makes it a little bit more interesting than eighth place. Goodbye, friends. Wow. Okay, now I'm in what? Oh, yeah, well, this is the classic stage that just. Yeah, I'm guessing it's gonna tell me to go away. It's such ex It's so windy and stuff that I'm sure making the stage follow the rules is probably very difficult. Also, what am I heading towards? What is that? Oh, that's the top thing. Okay. How's that not move? <laughs> Where's Yoshi? Oh, there he is. See you, friends. Dude, Mario Kart 8? This, this song in Mario Kart 8 was awesome. Why is that happening? <laughs> what happened again? I just won't drift this time. Maybe it's because I'm drifting during it. Sorry, I'm a drift fiend, man. That's all I do. Oh, God. It says I'm in fourth place. That means I'm just going to get, like, fourth place items. That's really buggy. <laughs> they should at least... If they're going to... Any criticism I can give to the moderator, or at least the person working on this, is don't put... Take, get, out, get rid of the item block right there. Because that's at the point when you're in, like... All the places start getting switched up. Or at least from what I can tell. Oh, yeah, wait. I was gonna try not to drift there. Such a driftable spot, though. Were those Piranha Plants in the Wii version? I remember those in the N64 version. <laughs> Yeah, if you let that cycle during that part, like, instead of, like, doing it quick, it's, like, it'll get you a really good item, probably. Wow. Yeah. Peach did it. Is that only the second stage? God dang. Baby Park. It's just so weird, because they're... It's all the Wii U one. Were they able to just, like... Were they able to just kind of like copy and paste like the Wii U one? Maybe. No, there's no way. It's probably a lot more intricately made than I think it is. Also, I love how the noises are for Wario, uh, Waluigi's pinball because this is probably overriding Waluigi's pinball. So like the noises when you get an item kind of sound like all like casino-y. That's because of that. Also, there's some sort of collision right there that's making me freak out. Wait, Toad isn't Leon. Just realized that. What? 
is what I haven't even been paying attention. Is what is Wario? Uh, fucking Crash Bandicoot. <laughs> Does it only work when you play as them? Maybe. Also, Music Park. Wow, that's cool. That's the that's the 3DS one. Dang. Ah, oh, it doesn't make the noise. In the 3DS one, it makes like a noise every time you hit one of the notes. You gotta move. I think those move. <laughs> those looked very, very still. <laughs> Ugh. Man, that is fun without the cool noises, but it's still pretty cool. It's like this is impressive. That is crazy. <laughs> what? Hey, 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 come on. What the heck? That was weird. And like, some of these uh, slopes, I think, are getting stuck on something with them. Ugh. Luigi. Bye, Luigi. I still have, like, my original Mario Kart DS cartridge with all of, like, the time trial things when I was, like, a kid. I cannot beat them for the life of me. I remember, like, trying to, like, sort of recently. I've just been, like, a god at this game when I was, like, 12 years old. I, it's crazy. Um... Yeah, I was like, I was, I was legitimately trying to beat it, like not so long ago. So I was like playing as Luigi with like a specific cart, and I was like, because one that's the thing that's really cool in Mario Kart DS specifically that I don't know if a lot of other Mario Kart games can even say they have. You can get every cart with every character in this game. There's no specific carts to specific characters. Well, there is in the beginning, but then you get the. You get like an unlockable is unlocking it so you can use any cart with anybody, which is really cool. I think Well, in Mario Kart, the newer Mario Kart games that's the case, but you like customize the cart completely. This might have been the first game to do something like that, which is really cool, because it, it leads to a lot of different stat like uh combinations, which is pretty cool. So I don't have to worry about those guys. I remember that. I thought that was such a cool mockable when I got this game originally. I was just like, what? Every card? You could pick 36 cards for every character. Which is like insane. Also, I was, I was just gonna say, where's the lightning? <laughs> lightning and blue shells, I'm barely seeing any of them. Also, why did. I feel like I was not small for very long. Oh, shoot. <laughs> Those are like little 2D sprites. I'm, yeah, I'm barely seeing any blue shells, which is interesting. I wonder if people aren't getting as many items. <laughs> I got Star Cup. 